The center, which is located about 12 kilometers outside Mariental, was established to impart skills to out-of-school and unemployed youth under the Ministry of Sport, Youth and National Services. Kain Nanahab is currently offering seven courses, while 15 new Namibia Qualification Framework registered occupational areas were also proposed for implementation by 2022. The Minister of Sport, Youth and National Services said the corporation aims to put resources and ideas together in reducing the youth unemployment rate by 2030. We have realized that uh, you know, working in isolation will not be a fruit for us. We have to put resources together. We have to put ideas together to achieve our goals. Vision 2030 is just nearby. And by putting heads together, it will help us to achieve that goal of Vision 2030. And this is what exactly the Minister of Higher Education has just mentioned here, that Minister of Higher Education and Minister of Sport, Youth, National Service have joined hands to ensure that the issue of our young people in Namibia the question of unemployment, skills development, is put forward. Higher Education Minister Dr. Itakanji Murangi pledged the continued support and cooperation of other ministries to provide the youth with necessary skills and development. We have fully agreed and Kai Kanahab will be transformed into a fully-fledged VTC that will ensure that foundation courses that will be offered by the Ministry of Youth as well as the TVET level uh, programs will be offered at that center, which means it will be run by the two ministries, a unique institution in the country where we cooperate in that manner. However, I believe it will not be the only one. Maybe in future as we proceed, looking at the possible successes that may come from this particular project, we will continue uh, to actually cooperate with the min this ministry so that indeed we ensure that our youth are given the right skills, our youth are put on the path <coughs> towards self-employment, and our youth are put on the path to ensuring that they contribute to the economic development of our country. The Namibia Training Authority will provide the funding and technical support for the center. Pauline Dalikokule, NBC News, Ventuk.